Right, we're still on day three, but she's beginning to get more confident here. More, this is my patch. So she is now calling and letting her presence be known. And the little dog, a couple of doors away, is responding. But this is how she would have done this before. Dogs do it. They kind of um, pack up, you know. Good girl, thank you. Sophie, good girl. Now all I'm doing is letting her know that I know he's there and that she doesn't have to worry. Or oh, she's marking her territory. Very, very common move. Good girl, thank you. Because she's not going on, what I'm going to do here is leave. I say leave, not abandon her, she's in the field. But I'm going to go back up here, see if she comes to look for my support. She's barked again, but what I'm showing her is I'm not bothered. She's not going on and on and on and on. She's just replying to the neighbour. You see, they can't, we put up fences, but they can't do that. They mark their territory, which she's done uh, there. Look at that. You see, she's, all she's done is, oh, we're not bothered. I've let her come away, knowing, a hey, good girl. Good girl. Oh, good girl. This is huge for her to keep coming to my hand. Because remember, for so long, all the presence of a person has meant is she gets hurt or yelled at. So, um, breaking that cycle. And she's happy, she might go down there and bark again. But that's fine. I don't mind at all. She can't, <laughs> I just knew it on cue. Good girl, thank you, Sophie. Gonna come away again. But you have to, because she doesn't go on, you see, this, this is, dogs like this are so near to wolves or free living canines because they understand the rules. This is why she's never jumped up at me. She doesn't offer to jump up at anybody because that comes with it. You learn not to do that as you get older. Not because it's, uh, it's not desired, it's not needed. Youngsters jump up, they get height gain, but we'll talk about that another time. But right now, all I'm working on is reassuring her that I'm here and I'm not bothered. That's the secret. So this is perceived danger, a slight threat, not a direct one. And now, as you can see, she's actually able to stroll around in this part of the garden. She knows where he is. She knows the location. But of course, now she's contained within a house and garden. So anyway. We'd be working on that, but we're only on day three, so uh, she's doing brilliantly. And I'm really getting on with clearing up. I'm wanting to come out in the garden again, which is nice. Marking her territory, yep. You do that, babe. She's a dog and she knows the rules. And that's the beauty of our machine, because it works with those natural rules. So she actually makes it easier for me. And our machine makes it easier for her. Brilliant.